Welcome to our YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to install three phase power analyzer in Transform MT site. So let's begin it. At first, we have to take a look on this. This is our three phase power analyzer uh, made by Crycard. You have seen the name over here, and here is the model number ALM35. Uh, there are several <coughs> many other models available in the market. This one is made by a French company, Crycard. You have seen here, and it costs over uh, three lakhs, I guess, isn't it? Okay. So here is the start button, and we're gonna start it here. You can see it. The starting progress hundred percent, and the machine have started. Now I'm gonna show you the connections. Uh, here you can show three probes. This one's red, yellow, and blue. These three are CTs, we known as current transformer. Now these are the CTs. You can see here range, and there are several types of CTs available in the market. This one is above hundred ampere, so it only can sense above hundred ampere. Uh, two three thousand ampere uh, let me show you this one is the direction of the current so you have to maintain the direction to get accurate results on your parameters this is three thousand ampere current and it's capable of three thousand ampere of current holding okay let's begin it this is voltage book and these are the voltage probes these are the voltage probes here yeah, you can see it it's yellow and red and blue here and the black one i mean the neutral one is attached in the live bus bar and remember friends i have to tell you that you must maintain the security measures while you have connected uh, you can see here it's a transformer over there. I would request my camera person to show you. Please uh, show them the transformer. And here you can see uh, it's the LT side of a transformer. Introduce you. Introduce you. And uh, I'm going to show you how to connect the CTs in the outgoing. So, as I have told you earlier, this is the direction of current and you can see here, the current is going through the pass bar to the cable. You can see here, several type of cables are here, indicated this is blue, yellow and red and neutral. Now, let's open it up this way, okay. So you have see friends, uh, there are three CTs connected in the adequate terminals and these are the voltage probes. I have connected one only and the rest I have to connect. Then come here I will show you. This one is the red one and this is the red terminal. This is the yellow one, okay? And the blue one over here. Now friends, uh, you have to wear a security safety gloves to, what can I say? Uh, to be safe, okay? <laughs> because it's <laughs> thousands of kvs here and if you don't wear gloves you'll go on and as i have seen you earlier these are the ct probes and these are the voltage probes i have just installed in the lt side and now this is the screen of our instrument and i can show you uh, this is the voltage line voltage uh, 
sorry at first i have seen you the phase the line voltage is here you can see red yellow and blue thereafter this is the ampere Uh, this is the ampere over here you can see it in three different phases and thereafter this is the single phase l1 l2 and l3 okay this is the phase sequence you can show this is the blue one and this is between three different phases you can see here 512 angles over here also this is crease factor for phase voltage phase current line voltage and different l1 l2 and l3 this is the thd it means total harmonic distortion we will discuss this thd in details in our next video you will <coughs> see there this is the rms and the sequence is same line voltage phase voltage current and l1 l2 and l3 now i am going to show you how to save the datas okay so this is the menu chart uh, these are the datas we have saved previously and in the new section you have to press this save button thereafter the save one is setup is one this is the general parameter you can set it up vigorously in the next or somehow if you want to eliminate some objects then you can set it up okay and the next one is start Today is 9 February 2019 and the time is shown over here you can see it also here now press enter and go through suppose I am uh, doing it uh, 1756 enter it again and the stop timer stop timer will be you can set it up to 24 hours as you re, uh, it means as you required to save it I just only require one hour so I'm gonna save it for a one hour okay and the period it means how long the machine will capture your data how continuously or how vigorously it will capture so I would uh, require here uh, five to one minutes as the time is short only one hour that's why I have put one minute if the time is to 24 hour you can go through 10 minutes and the name Uh, you can put the name that's why I am putting uh, data 2 there's data 2 then you go for ok and you can see it the recording on standby when it will be 556 the recording will progress and while you have to stop it this is the hand sign over here you have to put this one and the data will be stopped and you can see it over here like these datas this is the setting manual where you can change date and time then display calculation methods electrical connections sensor and ratios transient mode trend mode alarm mode and it is memory this is the snapshot button whenever you want to take a snapshot of uh, any specific reading or parameters over here you can take it through this one and this is the wattage you can see it uh, suppose I'm going to take it the snapshot I have taken it from here and you can see it Uh, and the next part is to the soft form of the data you have to you have to install data analyzer software in your PCs or laptop anywhere 
even if in your mobile also uh, the mobile version isn't available i think you have to use your pc only then uh, you install the same data to your uh, printer cable or uh, cable is attached over here to soft format then uh, you can attach it in your pc and download this data via those softwares and then only there is another software data view you can use it to download in it xls file and the pdf file and the graphs and the charts are will be there and you can easily understand the parameters like kilowatt kilowatt hour voltage ampere hour power factor crease factor total harmonic distortions etc in this session we have an <coughs> in this session we have uh, i think i clearly described all the functions of this instrument to you guys if you like this video please like our channel and please subscribe and don't forget to click that bell on the up to motivate us of course and we would like to share all our experiences in such electrical field hardcore electrical field to enlighten you about the world of electrical engineering so guys thank you today i'm ending this vlog and thanks to my channel partner mr shamir and oh i have forgotten my introducing myself myself ankan roy i am an electrical engineer working in energy india since last 3 years and i'm happy to deliver you such kind of videos thank you guys signing off